everyone, welcome back to the vlog today. I'm out in Cobor. Sam is not here because Sam has injured himself at work, which is great. But pretty much, I'm excited to be out here and test out, well, this is the first time I'm actually going forward driving with the turbo and twin locked. I went to the high country with the turbo, but that's just high country, so that doesn't really count. Yeah, I'm out here in Cobor with, what is it now? Snapped Media. Yep, snapped? that's it. Is snapped it just media. Snapped? Or snapped Media? Snapped. Just Snapped. We get a few snaps today. <laughs> Hopefully they don't snap anything. Yep. I mean, if you don't know this guy, you should know him. He'll be linked down below anyway. He used to be, was it Lincoln Off-Road Media? Lincoln Off-Road Media. Yep. Started a bit of a name change and uh, step it up a bit. So, let's see what we can get today. So we're actually out here filming a bit of a video for you. Well, we'll do a bit of both, yeah. Yeah. So, Mitch's car, pretty much done filming, but maybe head out a few more times and get some stuff for yours and show you around Cobol. So, I reckon we just get into it because I want to go drive stuff. Yeah, we just got, our two cars going. Um, I don't go off. My car doesn't go off road. Yeah. <laughs> I don't drive. It's in a video. Oh, said it. It's a car park. Car park queen. Car park queen. <laughs> it's on video. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I got no idea what tracks we're doing. I've never been to Cobor. Probably a good spot to, to test twin locked. Yeah. Really. Oh, this yeah. is the number sure. one spot to twin yeah. test lockers. How's the twin lockers? This is sick. It like came down and my foot like actually smacked the accelerator and it came down. I was like, oh, that made it way worse. A little rock garden. Good wheel lift. I mean, yeah, that was literally like the entry to the track. Yeah. <laughs> A tree root at the same time. Just get a little, little bump maybe. Go a little bit that way. Yeah. There you go. Nah, you're trying to climb front view at the same time. Go more left hand down. Yeah, they'll do, they'll do. Too much. Back my way a bit. Go back a bit. Go back a bit. Yep. Pump it. There you go. Lovely.
Hey, smell it. It's like just slipped into that hole. Yeah, that front end. Oh, you can throw the horse there. Nah, it's still in that. It'll still slip right, into the hole. He goes over that now. What's gonna happen on the front end? I won't feel great, but you go slowly. Yeah. I don't think you'll go anywhere. You look like okay. <laughs> All right, wait there, right? <laughs> Yeah, I keep going back a little bit. Turn this way now. And come forward with that. Okay, now I'll check it back over at least. I think it's it's on the diff as well. Well, you get to use the new winch. <laughs> new turbo. Nice free spool. <laughs> Pulls all right. Yeah, better than the old one. It does go a lot. New carbon winch. Central. <laughs> yeah, I reckon I should be up there. Yeah.
Yeah. It's just the leaf hangers. It's almost over. Yeah. It's gonna try and put them in the way, isn't it? It's just gonna hit the roof rack. So. Just slip the back into the rock. That's what, you're not in the bad spot. You go back there. Um, you're still alright. You're not in the bad spot. You want to go? Um, you want to go right here down though. The tires are digging everything out, and then it's like it's dug like almost a hole for itself in the bottom there. On that other side. Right, keep going back a little bit. Keep going back. It's fine. Right up from there. Point that way. It's like falling a little bit from there. Stay that way. Yeah, like that. The rear's, the rear's just hitting into the ground. I can't tell from here. I think the rear bar's like in the ground when it comes up. You could almost yeah. try and go back and see if you can climb back up that rock. Keep yeah, going, keep be. going. There you go from there. Come harder again, this way. There you go. Drive you. Turn it down and get up and get up. It's just so weird to drive down. <laughs> it's really annoying because you were nearly spot on there. It literally got to there and then went that way. These tyres are not Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah the rear slider is just. The rear slider is just. Harder, turn this way. Um, the other way, Jerry. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> keep going that way. Oh, yeah. Keep going, keep going. Up there. There there. Oh, it just needs a bit more. If you can get straight on that rock without these tires slipping, you'll you'll drive. Once it, it just gets over that, it should be alright. It's more the rear though. Yeah. Climb up that bank. Oh, oh yeah, 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 for sure. This is making me nervous. <laughs> <laughs> this angle right here, I don't like. <laughs> I could try pushing, you won't go anywhere. <laughs> yeah, don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh. ah. <laughs> that didn't sound nice. 
boy, everything with the board. Switch it over it. Oh, yeah, it's definitely that actually. Yeah. Turn this way if you can. doing its job. wasn't driving at all man. The front wasn't driving at all just then. Yeah, that's cool. yeah. Taking up tension now. Breakage. <laughs> You'll be able to get home, no yeah. worries, and yeah. yeah. Oh man, alright. Done myself a little bit of a mischief, just done the front hub, as you can see. Um, so, still get home, be able to fix it pretty easy. The car is very different to drive, not used to it at all, which is why I was stalling in heaps, because I'm not used to it stalling. Normally I can like not turn the idle up on this rock, rock kind of stuff, and then just crawl really slow. Um, but it's obviously like putting too much fuel in and laggy turbo doesn't have enough air. Twin locked is certainly different to drive for me. <laughs> it got on some angles. <laughs> it got on some angles. It's not really a, a rock crawling kind of car. It's not really an anything car except for touring because it's a true carrier. And like I'm quite inexperienced with this kind of driving too so it was all a massive change but it was fun. I'd definitely come back. Yeah some different tyres. Like these tyres they're not made for rocks. They're pretty bad on rocks. I'll probably nearly be better off on the razors if they weren't so worn down. But then like clearance becomes an issue in the rear. Just need traps really on bead locks. <laughs> let's, let's be honest, everyone needs traps on bead locks. But I think the plan is we're actually gonna take Tom's car out for the first time. And they're gonna go do... I do drive my car. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he was saying at the start of the video, he's like, I don't drive my car. No, I do. Now you drive it. <laughs> um, we can do a track called Pinnacles. We'll film them. And then I think we'll chuff off, but no, it's, it's good out here. As soon as that happened, I was like, oh. <laughs> that could have been avoided.
Yeah. <laughs>
Uh, nothing, really. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's fucking On the Very nice. I drove that rescue over there a real lot though, it wasn't on. Oh, you didn't have your real lot? No, it was flashing the entire time. Just making it difficult for you. No, yourself. always, yeah. yeah always. My third, third time driving it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was only in the middle of the slider. Nicely done. Not great when you hear a bunch of nuts and bolts falling out of your car. Yeah. <laughs>
All right, guys, it's the next day um, back home. As you can see, the, the hub is in the same condition as what it was. <laughs> Got a new one here. Figured I'd just throw it on at the end of the video. Um, managed to find this. Yeah, massive shout out to Angus uh, Wild 79 on Instagram because I could not get this anywhere. Um, Toyota wanted to absolutely rip me off. Not sell just this. <laughs> um, they wanted to sell heaps of other stuff. It's going to cost me like over 500 bucks for a hub. Well, that's the part of the hub. Um, but it's a bit worse than first thought. I uh, just pulled the car further in because it's going to be staying here tonight. Um, yet to pull it all apart. Looks like it's broken on the CV. So I dare say it's it snapped the axle and then because we drove a little bit then it smashed the hub. So I think that that is what would have happened. Pretty much that's just really annoying. I try and get it sorted. At least it is the front. Can just drive around in two wheel drive for my trip. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll update you guys with any further stuff. I'm kind of bummed, but whatever. Cup of coffee on the car floor, what's more, Triple J, ignorance today.